Remember that old Saturday Night Live skit, You Look Marvelous? Well, this is a marvelous house. Uh, it just looks great. You know, when we shoot these houses, Ken sends me out, or Dan sends, Jeremy sends me out to shoot these houses. I have to think mentally about what to say, and then when I get back, they inevitably ask me, well, how did it shoot? So I'll say, oh, well, that was the house with the, with the horses, or that was the house with the whatever. Well, this is the house with the ginormous rooms. So it's all brick, it's got dimensional shingles, it's got the big two-car garage. It's a great location. A lot of retired folks, a lot of families. You know, you kind of scope out the neighborhood to see what it's like. You, know, you want to know what a neighborhood's like, come by on a, on a weekend sometime and, and see what people are doing. Uh, these folks, they've got a small family, two little kids that just went in there. These people are, I'm assuming, retired. They're out mowing the grass. It's Friday afternoon, right? So uh, nice yards, nice gardens, nice flower beds, and uh, vegetable gardens and that sort of thing. Well, look at this place, right? I don't know what this is. It's not a beach, I don't think. Oh, well, maybe it is. But it's really dark, dark purple. Leaves are beautiful. So if you know what it is, put it down here at the bottom of the... Uh, of the video if you can they're still planting flowers they just listed the house and they're still planting flowers how crazy so you know that it's taken care of meticulously anyway let me show you around back this is a, a red maple so pretty but anyway real pretty they get the flowers nice deck look at this backyard total privacy they got like uh, this is for drainage so you never have to worry about your house getting any water in it right this is drainage goes down into there so you're nice and uh, drained all the time you can mow the grass you know I used to live in a place it would rain and it would take you four days before you can mow the grass you can mow the grass here and nice and high and dry look how pretty all right enough jibber jabber let's go on inside oh by the way you've got uh, knockout roses there trimmed up and like to a ball you got old hollyhocks it's like a real old-fashioned kind of thing you can boxwood and all that stuff I don't know what this stuff is. Is this the same as that tree? I don't know. It's beautiful. And it's soft. It's almost like leather. So you got coins. Those pop-outs here. Beautiful soldiers around the circle top window. And the garage is really nice and neat and clean. Let's go on inside. Oak floors here when you walk right in. And this bright, cheery yellow foyer. It's kind of neat. You got a big coat closet there, little closet there. That's actually a bedroom, which is really cool. It's got like a Jack and Jill bath. Look at this guy, huh? <whistles> Vaulted ceiling. Doesn't matter what size the room, and this size, this room is huge, but it doesn't matter what size room it is, when you put a vaulted ceiling, it makes it feel even bigger. So Ken, Ken will tell me how big it is, and I'll put it here. I'm going to guess it's 20 by 20. It's a big room. Like two-car garage size, right? And it's a big, beautiful living room. So what do we have here? Gas logs and then this brick, fire brick. You can just turn them on, enjoy the heat, enjoy the flame. When you're done, you shut them off. Nice and safe. Another closet right there. Look at that. So you're looking at, well, that's seven... 13, 14 foot ceiling. Nice dining room. Patio doors right out to the deck. Perfect for entertaining. The kitchen's great. Lots of cabinets. Got tile backsplash here. Hardwood floors. Stainless appliances. I don't know if the appliances stay or not. I'll put that here if I know, or whatever you talk to Ken about that. But uh, stainless fridge, stainless uh, stove. Lots of cabinet space. I'll show, I'm going to show you this later. I'll save that for last. So you know that's nice. If I'm saving it for last, you know that's got to be cool. Here's a um, laundry room. Got the water he heater there, which looks... Pretty new. Alright, so remember that's a bedroom. This is a bedroom. 
and then you've got a bathroom. So what do you call that? Hollywood, Jack and Jill? I don't know exactly what you call it, but that's what we call it. One of those things. Double door closets, double bifolds. Full bath here. And then you can kind of go right through. And there you go. Another double closet. Crazy. Crazy. And this is this is a big bedroom. You could do two beds end to end here. I mean, the rooms are good size. See how that works? And then here we're in the foyer. Love it. Love it. Okay. Now, my favorite part of the house, who cares about me? It's about you, right? My favorite part of the house, check this out. you got to be kidding me. Here again, I don't know how big it is. If I know, I'm going to put it here, but it's got to be, it's got to be 16 by 20. That is a huge master bedroom with, of course, a walk-in closet. And a big old, big old jumbo bathroom. Hoppers over there. Huge closet. Shower, of course. I'm going to measure this thing before I leave. <laughs> I just absolutely love this master bedroom. And then right on out to the deck. Throw a hot tub out there. Whatever. What would you like out there? Roll nice. You know that's a good quality door. And there are those flowers. You have a grill out here. And this goes into the dining room. You have a hot tub over here. In this area. And this goes right to the master bedroom. I told you it was nice. I told you it was sweet. I told you it was big. I'm so glad you got to see this house. It's in Harrodsburg. It's just a couple miles from town in one of the prettiest, prettiest areas. I'll put a, uh, an aerial right here. But you literally just go right out here and you're on 68. Make a right. You go up to Shaker Town, Shaker Village, uh, Lexington. All the gorgeous horse farms, Shawnee Farm. It's one of the most beautiful thoroughbred farms in the state. And it's just right up the street, literally two, three miles. Maybe two miles, three miles into town. And Harrodsburg's got everything. Got lots of jobs, lots of industry. Uh, just to give you an idea, their industrial park, they have put in $550 million dollars in expansions in the last three years. It's a real town with real jobs, real industry, and real confidence. Big companies like Corning, Wausau, Hitachi, real companies spending real money on a real area because it's beautiful. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. Love this house. You're going to love it too. Give Ken a call. The phone number is right there and we'll put you in this house. We'll get you uh, maybe a great loan. He's got some Deals out there right now, 0% down, 100% loans, um, USDA loans. Those are fantastic loans. Give Ken a call. We will hook you up. Thank you for watching. Bye. Oh, here, I already said thank you and goodbye. But what I wanted to do is I want to show you the garage. So it's not thank you, goodbye yet. I want to show you this garage. I wish my garage was this neat. I wish my garage was one-tenth as neat as this is. How cool is this place? Neat, clean, two car garage, zoom right in the house. Love it. Okay, now, thanks for watching. Goodbye.